Welcome to Inside Out Boys with your host, Cody Bass. Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Big welcome and hello to all the new subscribers. Thank you for subscribing. Um, yeah, I'm going to do a quick facts check on a particular motor. And I'll show you what that is in a minute. But I want to say happy Thanksgiving to everybody out there. And, uh, you know, I'm just going to leave it at that. Say happy Thanksgiving and please stay safe. That's what they're telling us to do. So, be safe, be well, and happy Thanksgiving. So, yeah, I've got uh, a couple of different motors I'm going to be showing you in this vid. And uh, then we're going to do a quick facts check on one of them. So, let's get at it. Everybody knows what it means when I wear this hat. It means someone came bearing gifts. It means it's Christmas in November. You want to see it? Let's go take a look. Well. Here's the first one. I just went and picked this one up a day or so ago. It's a Merc 70 oil injected tilt trim. And over there by that beat up prop, I have the controls and cables and all for it. The guy don't know much about it. I haven't taken the bonnet off yet. The guy I got it from said he really don't know much about it. It was given to him. Been sitting in his backyard. He wanted it out of there. I said, I'll come get it. So I went and got it. There it is. The Merc 70 oil injected. Here's the other one. The 40 Enduro. You 
you can see the tiller handle there is all foobarred and busted up, the transom bracket. But it's just like that other one I got. Let me set you down here and get the bonnet off. And there we go. And this one I can reach under and it turns over. Yeah, she turns over. She turns over. It's just like that other one I got that was the European made one. Twin cylinders and a single carb. And it turns over, and just by hand, it feels like it has good compressiones. You want a status. So I was gifted that one. A friend of mine brought it by. It was given to him. He said he had no use for it. So he brought it to me. That's one I hope to make a twin to my European model one. You can see the, the bonnets are a little different. The paint scheme and so forth. But I was really happy to get this one. Yes, sir. Good stuff. Christmas in November. name that tune history shows again and again how nature points up the folly of man history shows again and again how nature points up the folly of man name that tune this is an old, uh, older Honda generator. Um, that I got. That somebody set beside a dumpster. Ugh. Heavier than it looks. But, when I took the, this cover off here, the plastic cover, it really don't look that bad and uh, I checked the oil it's real dirty but uh, it's there you know I mean it, it's got oil in it and so I'm just okay so this says off, off. on and then choke yep the choke seems to be working so I think what I'm gonna do is go out and just see if I got any jerry can gas left. I might have used it all on my ramrod. But it's dirty and everything. But uh, the carb's clean and everything. Um, creepy crowley. 
Let's see how does this air filter work? How does that work? You push thing here, maybe? Yep. The air filter ain't bad. Be clean in there. A little condensation. But the air filter ain't bad at all. Let me go see if I got any gas out there. Because I did look in the tank and it's uh it's out of gas, but that inside of that tank is spotless. So let me go see if I got any gas. I'll be right back. Yeah, I had some gas out there. So I'm gonna just put a little bit in there. Not a lot of it, just a little bit. a little bit cap full of that or so in there we go and maybe just a tad more there we go uh, put a little bit in Never know. Okay. Shake that up a little bit. Uh oh, what's going on there? I guess I just splashed it out the overflow, didn't I? All right. Let's see. Who knows? So it pulls straight up, I guess. So we need it on choke. About that I want you to look how dirty this thing is on the outside <laughs> look at this yeah how dirty that thing is but dang she's dirty like I said it's a dumpster fine I'll see if it'll start once it's warm without the choke. Oh, what's that for? Reset, maybe? That's your old, low oil alert. Let me see if I can find a light. Just a minute.
I took off. It just has two quick clamps. Um, but I'm going to clean it all up. Well, here's the freebie mercury. Three cylinder. Um, move them out of my way. Let me move that out of my way. Wait a minute. Now, hopefully, it'll drip down. <laughs> now, I can get a spark plug wrench. Got brand new looking plugs in it, NGKs. And we're going to do just a quick fax check on it. Here's what I know about the engine. The guy that gave it to me said it had been sitting in his backyard the way I found it for several years. Now you say, what do you mean the way you found it? The way I found it was upside down. Boop, boop, boop. You know, it's the trouble with using all these different cameras I forget where things are but anyway before I do the compressiones check this ain't no pull start motor this is an electric motor so that means that uh, I'm going to hope she turns over with that start. And that's why I took the plugs out, just to make it easy for But I'm picking up this hardware, because I don't want to lose that. We get 90, 95, 100, 105. So we were getting 90 on all three dry, 105 on all wet. So those are pretty good numbers. Those are pretty good n -n 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 numbers. But we gotta get rid of that. Can't have that. We got to write 105 on there. Actually, it was 104. So. We got 104. That's four. <laughs> then we got 105. Then we got one zero five. That's the numbers. I don't look much like a zero, does it? All right. Now let's get us a spocky spot. Let's see if we got any spocky while we're doing all this. Oh, is that the one of normal ones? There's a one, two, a three. Right. Let's see what we get in the old Spock situation. Okay. 
Let's look right in here. Make sure you're in there. Right there. Should be right in there somewhere. Just turn the key so we'll get it. We got hot spot on three. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. We are rocking and rolling on three, y'all. That's right. Rocking and rolling. I just love it when people give me outboards that I bring home. And uh, this thing's got the VRO. It's dirty for the creepy crawly if I want to get me. But, um, gosh, we talk about good deal stuff, man. Cards are all free. But this thing is fast, too. Um, yeah, I could. With that tri flow in there, I bet she'd pop over. But I don't think I want to do that. I ain't got it hooked to any water or anything. I mean, it wouldn't hurt it probably, but it's gonna probably need a new impeller anyway. But I just want to keep the air out of them cylinders right now. What numbers are these? NGK, these are BUHW 2. Never even heard of them ones. I'll have to run them, run them plugs. I don't know. I don't know. Let me see what this one was. There's the number. Yep, BUHW-2. That's what it. That's what it's got in it. Don't know if that's what it's supposed to be. But they're in like new shape. They look really good. This whole motor actually looks really good. I don't know what this thing is here. What is this here? Is that some kind of rain change fair air guide marine? I think it says barometer. Thing might actually work. Yeah, marine barometer. Ain't that a pretty setup? Look at there. That screams commercial fisherman. And then, <laughs> where is it? Yeah, got a Evan Rude coil pack tied to it. <laughs> What's that? Oh, two Evan Root coil packs tied to it. I don't know. Right here. Little custom. Yeah. I'll get it all straightened out. But, uh... Well. That's as far as I'm going to go with this one um, right now. Um, before I even probably try and fire it, I'll do at least air blow it, blow it off with some compressed air, clean it up a little bit, and put a little more oil in the VRO, that kind of thing. So, but she looks like she's going to be a runner. It's got good compression, good spark. Key switch works, starter works. I'll be happy to come get it out your backyard upside down on his head, you understand? I sure will. So, again, Happy Thanksgiving, everybody! All right, that is going to be one more hack.
from Kodiak. Happy Thanksgiving. Don't forget to like and subscribe to Inside Outboards with your host, Cody Bass.